Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A man is giving a presentation in an office. B. A group of people is attending a business meeting. C. People are waiting in line for a sale in a store. D. A woman is taking notes in a shopping mall. The correct answer is D. A woman is taking notes in a shopping mall. Number 2. A. A group of construction workers is reviewing a blueprint. B. Two people are studying a chalkboard on a construction site. C. A person is shopping in a supermarket. D. People are having a picnic in a park. The correct answer is B. Two people are studying a chalkboard on a construction site. Number 3. A. A man is reading a newspaper in a coffee shop. B. People are sitting around a table. C. A man is typing on a laptop at an airport. D. A woman is running on a treadmill. The correct answer is C. A man is typing on a laptop at an airport. Number 4. A. A man is giving a presentation in a cafe. B. A group of people is having a meeting in a park. C. Several workers are cleaning a building. D. Two people are painting a wall. The correct answer is A. A man is giving a presentation in a cafe. Number 5. A. A waiter is serving food to a table. B. A group of chefs is preparing food in the kitchen. C. A couple is dining at a restaurant while looking at an electronic menu. D. People are waiting in line to order food. The correct answer is C. A couple is dining at a restaurant while looking at an electronic menu. Number 6. A. Workers are fixing equipment in a factory. B. Some people are having a meeting outdoors. C. A group of tourists is visiting a historical site. D. A woman is working on her computer in a meeting room. The correct answer is D. A woman is working on her computer in a meeting room. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Who is responsible for the training session? A. Mr. Johnson will handle it. B. The training starts at 9 a.m. C. Yes, I attended the last session. The correct answer is A. Mr. Johnson will handle it. Number 2. Where can I find the new report? A. On your desk. B. Ask the manager. C. It's being printed. The correct answer is A. On your desk. Number 3. How do you get to the train station from here? A. She prefers the bus. B. I'm going at 6 p.m. C. Take a left turn and go straight. The correct answer is C. Take a left turn and go straight. Number 4. Why are the lights off? A. The power is out. B. I'll contact the electrician. C. We have new lights installed. The correct answer is A. The power is out. Number 5. Can you help me with these boxes? A. Yes, it contains fragile items. B. I need to check my schedule. C. Sure, I'd be happy to help.
The correct answer is C. Sure, I'd be happy to help. Number 6. When is the next company event? A. Next month on the 5th. B. I'll be on vacation then. C. It was fun last year. The correct answer is A. Next month on the 5th. Number 7. Can you handle this without assistance? A. Yes, I can manage. B. The files are in the drawer. C. We went yesterday. The correct answer is A. Yes, I can manage. Number 8. Can you help me with this? A. I'm very busy. B. Of course, I'd be happy to. C. Let's do it later. The correct answer is B. Of course, I'd be happy to. Number 9. Who is in charge of the new project? A. Yes, I'll handle that. B. Mr. Johnson is. C. It's a marketing project. The correct answer is B. Mr. Johnson is. Number 10. Do you know where the IT department is? A. Yes, I work there. B. No, I really enjoy my job. C. It's on the third floor. The correct answer is C. It's on the third floor. Number 11. Why is the conference room booked? A. I'm not sure. B. At 3 p.m. C. There's a team meeting. The correct answer is C. There's a team meeting. Number 12. Which department handles customer complaints? A. I will file a complaint soon. B. The customer service department. C. Yes, they are very efficient. The correct answer is B. The customer service department. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. Can you help me with the presentation slides? Sure. When do you need them by? I need to present them tomorrow afternoon. I'll start working on them right away. When does the man need the presentation slides? A. Tomorrow morning. B. Today. C. Tomorrow afternoon. The correct answer is C. Tomorrow afternoon. Number 2. Have you filed the expense report yet? Not yet. I'm planning to do it this afternoon. Okay. Just remember to include the receipts. I will. Thanks for the reminder. When will the man file the expense report? A. This afternoon. B. This morning. C. Tomorrow. The correct answer is A. This afternoon. Number 3. I need to reschedule our meeting. Are you free at 4 p.m. instead? Let me check. Yes, 4 p.m. works. Perfect. I'll send a new invite. Thanks. What time will the rescheduled meeting be? A. At 5 p.m. B. At 4 p.m. C. At 3 p.m. The correct answer is B. At 4 p.m. Number 4. Have you received the updated budget proposals yet? Not yet. They were supposed to be sent this morning. Please follow up with the finance department. I'll do that now. What is the woman supposed to follow up on? A. Project timelines. B. Meeting schedule. C. Updated budget proposals. The correct answer is C. Updated budget proposals. Number 5. When will the new software update be released? We are scheduled to release it next Monday. That's great. Will there be a training session? Yes, there will be a session on Tuesday morning. When is the software update scheduled to be released? A. Next Monday. B. Next Friday. C. 
next Wednesday. The correct answer is A. Next Monday. Number 6. Have you completed the budget review for the new project? Almost. I need another hour. Great. We can go over it together after lunch. Sounds good. I'll see you at 1 p.m. When will they go over the budget review? A. At 1 p.m. B. After lunch. C. In an hour. The correct answer is B. After lunch. Number 7. Can we discuss the marketing plan after lunch? Sure, I have time around 1.30 p.m. Perfect, I'll see you then. Let's meet in my office. When will they discuss the marketing plan? A. After lunch. B. Before lunch. C. In the morning. The correct answer is A. After lunch. Number 8. Can you help me with the presentation for the client meeting tomorrow? Sure, what do you need? I'd like some help with the data analysis slides. No problem, I'll get started on that right away. What does the woman need help with? A. Scheduling the meeting. B. Booking a conference room. C. Analyzing the data. The correct answer is C. Analyzing the data. Number 9. Our system is down and we can't process orders. I'll contact IT support immediately. Please do. We can't afford to lose sales. I'll keep you updated on the situation. What is the issue mentioned? A. The system is malfunctioning. B. Customer inquiries. C. The server is down. The correct answer is A. The system is malfunctioning. Number 10. Do you need any help with the presentation for next week's conference? Yes, some feedback on the slides would be great. I'll take a look at them and get back to you by tomorrow. Thanks. That would be really helpful. When will the woman give feedback? A. Today. B. Next week. C. Tomorrow. The correct answer is C. Tomorrow. Number 11. Did you finish the budget review? Almost. I need another hour. Okay. Make sure it's ready before the meeting at 2 p.m. Will do. What time is the meeting? A. At 3 p.m. B. At 2 p.m. C. At 1 p.m. The correct answer is B. At 2 p.m. Number 12. Are you attending the conference next week? Yes, I have already registered. Great. I'll see you there then. Looking forward to it. When is the conference? A. In two weeks. B. This week. C. Next week. The correct answer is C. Next week. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Our cooking class schedule for this summer includes special sessions on vegetarian cooking, baking, and international cuisine. Classes will be held every Saturday afternoon from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. Don't forget to register in advance as spots fill up quickly. When are the cooking classes being held? A. Every Sunday from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. B. Every Saturday from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. C. Every Friday from 1 p.m. to 3 p.m. The correct answer is B. Every Saturday from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. Number 2. Good evening, residents. Our team will be conducting road maintenance on Elm Street from Monday to Wednesday next week. Please plan alternate routes to avoid delays. Thank you for your cooperation. When will the road maintenance on Elm Street take place? A. Next week, Monday to Wednesday. B. This weekend. C. Tomorrow. The 
The correct answer is C. Next week, Monday to Wednesday. Number 3. Our company is excited to announce a new range of eco-friendly products. These items are made from sustainable materials and are fully recyclable. We believe that small changes can make a big impact. Join us in our effort to reduce waste and protect the planet. What is the main topic of the announcement? A. New range of eco-friendly products. B. Company's annual profit. C. Upcoming company events. The correct answer is B. New range of eco-friendly products. Number 4. Our environmental campaign targets plastic waste reduction. You can contribute by using reusable bags and bottles and properly recycling plastics. Join us in making a difference for a sustainable future. Visit our website for more information and tips. How can people contribute to reducing plastic waste? A. By ignoring recycling. B. By increasing plastic production. C. By using reusable bags and bottles. The correct answer is B. By using reusable bags and bottles. Number 5. Attention, all employees. The company will be conducting a fire drill on Friday at 10 a.m. Please familiarize yourself with the evacuation routes and gather at the designated assembly area. Do not use the elevators during the drill. Participation is mandatory. When will the fire drill take place? A. 9 a.m. B. 11 a.m. C. 10 a.m. The correct answer is C. 10 a.m. Number 6. Attention shoppers. We are excited to announce a special 50% off sale on all winter apparel starting tomorrow. Don't miss out on the chance to update your wardrobe with our latest collection. Sale continues until stocks last. What is the discount rate for the sale? A. 30% off. B. 50% off. C. 25% off. The correct answer is B. 50% off. Number 7. The town's annual charity run will take place this Saturday starting at 7.30 a.m. Participants are encouraged to arrive early for registration and warm-up activities. The route will cover 5 kilometers through the city park. All proceeds will go towards local children's hospitals. What is the length of the charity run route? A. 10 kilometers. B. 3 kilometers. C. 5 kilometers. The correct answer is A. 5 kilometers. Number 8. Attention residents. There will be a water supply interruption tomorrow from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. due to maintenance work. We apologize for the inconvenience and appreciate your understanding. Please store enough water for your needs. Why will there be a water supply interruption? A. To save water. B. Due to maintenance work. C. To clean the tanks. The correct answer is C. Due to maintenance work. Number 9. This is a reminder that the town hall meeting will take place this Wednesday at 6 p.m. in the City Council Chamber. The agenda includes budget discussions and community project updates. All residents are encouraged to attend and voice their opinions. When will the town hall meeting take place? A. This Wednesday at 6 p.m. B. Next Wednesday at 5 p.m. C. This Thursday at 7 p.m. The correct answer is B. This Wednesday at 6 p.m. Number 10. Attention shoppers! Our store is having a big sale this weekend, with discounts up to 50% off. The sale includes items from all departments. Come early to catch the best deals. Thank you for choosing to shop with us. What is the maximum discount available during the sale? A. 50%. B. 30%. C. 
The correct answer is C. 50%. Number 11. Thank you for attending our annual Technology Expo. This year, we are showcasing innovations in artificial intelligence and virtual reality. Make sure to visit our demo booths to experience the latest gadgets. Don't miss the keynote speech at 4 p.m. in the main hall. What time is the keynote speech scheduled? A. 3 p.m. B. 5 p.m. C. 4 p.m. The correct answer is A. 4 p.m. Number 12. Welcome aboard this flight to New York. Our cabin crew is here to ensure you have a comfortable journey. Please pay attention to the safety demonstration and fasten your seatbelt when seated. We will be serving refreshments shortly. If you need any assistance, don't hesitate to ask. What are passengers asked to do during the flight? A. Fasten their seatbelt when seated. B. Stand during takeoff. C. Ignore the safety demonstration. The correct answer is B. Fasten their seatbelt when seated. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one. The company has expanded its operations in 2010. A. Since. B. On. C. In. D. Four. The correct answer is A. Since. Number 2. The new policy will come into effect next month. A. In. B. By. C. On. D. At. The correct answer is C. On. Number 3. The meeting. At 10 a.m. yesterday. A. Started. B. Starting. C. Starts. D. Will start. The correct answer is A. Started. Number four. If they more time, they would finish the project sooner. A. Have. B. Would have. C. Had. D. Will have. The correct answer is C. Had. Number 5. They haven't completed the project. Until. A. Yet. B. Any more. C. Still. D. Already. The correct answer is A. Yet. Number 6. If it. Ish. Will cancel the outdoor event. A. Has rained. B. Will rain. C. Rained. D. Rains. The correct answer is D. Rains. Number 7. The company. Its financial report annually. A. Published. B. Publishes. C. Has published. D. Is publishing. The correct answer is B. Publishes. Number 8. The report. Finished by the time they arrive tomorrow. A. Will have been. B. Will be. C. Was. D. Has been. The correct answer is A. Will have been. Number 9. The instructions were Confusing for me to follow. A. Enough. B. Such. C. 2. D. So. The correct answer is C. 2. Number 10. Would you mind? Me a hand with this task? 
A. Giving. B. Give. C. Gave. D. To give. The correct answer is A. Giving. Number 11. They. Here since 2010. A. Have worked. B. Worked. C. Are working. D. Had worked. The correct answer is A. Have worked. Number 12. The project was difficult than they expected. A. Two. B. So. C. More. D. Most. The correct answer is C. More. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. The company picnic has been moved to the Central Park due to Weather conditions. A. Unfavored. B. Unfavorable. C. Unfavorably. D. Unfavor. The correct answer is B. Unfavorable. Number 2. Ms. Lee has worked with us for over 10 years and has consistently exceptional performance. We are happy to offer her a promotion. A. Demonstrate. B. Demonstrated. C. Demonstration. D. Demonstrating. The correct answer is B. Demonstrated. Number 3. 2. All employees, please note that the meeting has been until next Monday. Regards, management. A. Rescheduled. B. Reschedule. C. Rescheduling. D. Reschedules. The correct answer is A. Rescheduled. Number 4. The committee has decided to the proposal. Further details will be shared in the next meeting. Warm regards, committee chair. A. Approval. B. Approved. C. Approves. D. Approve. The correct answer is D. Approve. Number 5. The marketing department will be hosting a seminar on advertising strategies. Next week. A. Starts. B. Start. C. Starting. D. Started. The correct answer is C. Starting. Number 6. Please be aware that the construction work will Some noise disruptions. We appreciate your understanding and cooperation. A. Cause. B. Causes. C. Causing. D. Caused. The correct answer is A. Cause. And finally, Part 7, Reading, Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Thank you for subscribing to our monthly newsletter. This issue includes top tips for improving workplace productivity, an interview with our CEO, and highlights from our recent product launch event. Be sure to stay tuned for next month's edition for more valuable insights. What topics are included in this newsletter edition? A. Job openings. B. Holiday announcements. C. Productivity tips and CEO interview. The correct answer is C. Productivity tips and CEO interview. Number 2. Dear employees, we are pleased to announce the introduction of a new software system, Design Nishti, to improve our workflow efficiency. Training sessions will be held next week, and attendance is mandatory. Please refer to the email sent by the HR department for the training schedule. Thank you for your cooperation. What is the main purpose of this announcement? A. To notify about a change in office hours. B. To inform about a company picnic. C. To announce a new software system.
The correct answer is C. To announce a new software system. Number 3. Our team is thrilled to announce a synergy meeting set for Thursday, October 10th at 3 p.m. in Conference Room B. We will discuss the strategic plan for the upcoming quarter with an emphasis on achieving our sales targets. Refreshments will be provided. We look forward to your active participation. What is the purpose of the meeting? A. To announce a merger. B. To discuss sales strategies. C. To plan a team outing. The correct answer is B. To discuss sales strategies. Number 4. Attention all gym members. From next Monday, we will be extending our closing hours to 11 p.m. on weekdays. This decision comes after numerous member requests. We hope this change will better accommodate your fitness schedules. Thank you for your feedback. What change is being announced? A. Extended closing hours on weekdays. B. Reduced membership fees. C. Addition of new fitness classes. The correct answer is A. Extended closing hours on weekdays. Number 5. Join us for a free webinar on financial planning this Thursday at 2 p.m. Learn from experts about budgeting, investing, and retirement planning. Register online by visiting our website. What is the main topic of the webinar? A. Health and wellness. B. Financial planning. C. Career development. The correct answer is B. Financial planning. Number 6. Dear team, we are thrilled to announce that we have been awarded the Industry Leader Award for this year. This recognition reflects our team's hard work and dedication. Let's continue striving for excellence. Congratulations, the Executive Board. What is the main purpose of this announcement? A. To plan a meeting. B. To announce an award received. C. To introduce new products. The correct answer is B. To announce an award received. Number 7. Dear Team. Due to recent changes in our project timeline, the deadline for the Q4 report has been extended to November 15th. We appreciate your hard work and dedication to ensuring the success of this project. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. What is the key information in this announcement? A. Team meeting. B. Extension of a deadline. C. Project cancellation. The correct answer is B. Extension of a deadline. Number 8. Dear customers, we're happy to introduce our new loyalty program, Earn Points with Every Purchase, which can be redeemed for discounts on future orders. Sign up today and receive bonus points. Thank you for being a valued customer. Regards, customer service. What is being introduced in the announcement? A. A change in store hours. B. A new loyalty program. C. A price increase. The correct answer is B. A new loyalty program. Number 9. Dear travel enthusiasts, join us for an exciting webinar on Exploring Europe on a Budget next Wednesday at 7 p.m. Learn tips and tricks for making the most of your travel experience without breaking the bank. Visit our website to register and secure your spot. What is the topic of the webinar? A. Luxury travel destinations. B. Exploring Europe on a budget. C. Business travel tips. The correct answer is B. Sustainable tourism. Number 10. Attention residents. Please be aware that there will be a scheduled water outage on Tuesday, October 10th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. for maintenance. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. Thank you for your understanding. Sincerely, Maintenance Team. When will the water outage occur? A. Monday, October 9th all day. B. Tuesday, October 10th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. C. 
Wednesday, October 11, from 12 p.m. to 4 p.m. The correct answer is B. Thursday, October 12th, from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. Number 11. Effective from next month, the office working hours will shift to 9 a.m., 6 p.m. to better accommodate our clients' needs. All departments are expected to adhere to the new timetable. We appreciate your understanding and cooperation in this adjustment period. What is changing? A. Office working hours. B. Employee benefits. C. Office locations. The correct answer is A. Office working hours. Number 12. Dear shareholders, we are pleased to report that our annual revenue has exceeded projections by 15%. This success is attributed to our new product launches and expanded market reach. We will continue to drive innovation and growth in the coming year. Thank you for your continued support. Sincerely, the Board of Directors. What is the key achievement mentioned in the report? A. The company held a large event. B. A new CEO has been appointed. C. The annual revenue exceeded projections. The correct answer is C. The annual revenue exceeded projections. Number 13. The Green Trail Marathon will be held on July 12th. Participants should register online by July 5th to secure their spots. The event will start at 7 a.m. from Pine Park and cover a distance of 21 kilometers. When is the deadline to register for the Green Trail Marathon? A. July 1st. B. July 10th. C. July 5th. The correct answer is C. July 7th. Number 14. We are thrilled to announce our annual company picnic, taking place on October 3rd at Hillside Park. All employees and their families are welcome. There will be food, games, and activities for all ages. Please RSVP by September 25th. What is the purpose of this announcement? A. To invite employees to a company event. B. To cancel a planned event. C. To inform about the location of the park. The correct answer is A. To invite employees to a company event. Number 15. Dear customers, starting from next month, all our branches will open an hour earlier on weekdays. The new opening time will be 8 a.m. This change is aimed at providing better service and accommodating the needs of our customers. Thank you for your continued support. What is the new opening time on weekdays? A. 8 a.m. B. 9 a.m. C. 7 a.m. The correct answer is A. 8 a.m. Number 16. We are pleased to inform you that our annual fundraising gala will be held at the Hilton Grand Ballroom on November 5th. This event is crucial for raising money to support underprivileged children in our community. Your attendance and contributions are greatly appreciated. What is the main purpose of the event? A. To raise funds for underprivileged children. B. To celebrate the Hilton Grand Ballroom. C. To announce a celebrity attendance. The correct answer is A. To raise funds for underprivileged children. Number 17. Notice. The elevator in Building B will be under maintenance from October 1st to October 3rd. During this period, please use the staircases located at the north and south ends of the building. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause and appreciate your understanding. What is the purpose of this notice? A. To promote staircase use. B. To announce a building closure. C. To inform about elevator maintenance. The correct answer is C. To inform about elevator maintenance. Number 18. Our latest product, the Supersonic Blender, is now available for pre-order. 
Featuring state-of-the-art technology and a sleek design, this blender can tackle any kitchen task with ease. Order now and receive a free recipe book with your purchase. What is being advertised? A. A kitchen renovation service. B. A new blender. C. A recipe book. The correct answer is B. A new blender.